the one and only Digo Double G. Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg. Da, 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 da. You know I'm hopping with the D-R-E. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. You know the West Coast is Ooh. bad for all you uh. Hey, what's up guys? Ty here from Red Dot Fish. We are going to do some crab fishing today. It's really early in the morning. Sun's just coming up right now. There's a lot of fog, it's cold. But we're gonna go get those crabs today. So um, check out the new shirts, Red Dot Fish. Let's go. Anyways, um, I'm still waking up. I got my coffee right here. Oh yeah. Okay, friends, we're on the boat. Doing so, we're gonna do some crab fishing. Hopefully, you can hear me today. I don't have a mic on right now, but I'll put it on in a minute. Fix this a little bit. Um, we're here out at the coast of California, Northern California. Check it out. What's up friends? All five pots are in, three crab pots, two rings. Ryan and I just got all the them baited up and down. We're about, we're in approximately 60 feet of water here in Northern California off the coast. I would say we're off the coast about at least a mile, maybe a mile and a half. And uh, we're gonna let our crab cages soak for probably an hour or two. And we're gonna let our ring pots soak for like 15 minutes. So. Stay tuned, hopefully we catch some good crap. It's only a few days before Christmas and one observation that we had today, the weather has settled down and there are not a lot of crab pots out in the water today. So I'm thinking because of Christmas and all that, the people are back home with their families and doing this and that. Hopefully we get some crab today. We make a good video for you guys and we'll do a catch and cook in a little bit. So let's cut to, Tell me, dude. let's cut to Ryan doing a dance. You gotta show me, dude. You're Go not ahead. the only one in the video. Go ahead, talk. It's on. I just talked. You wanna say that? Oh! Oh! Jesus, Brock, I'm sorry. Oh, oh, shit. What happened? I hooked him in the neck. No. Okay, what you got here is a male red oh, rock. Okay. Yeah, it is. A male red rock crab. And uh, this is our third crab of the day. He's got to be over four inches, but we don't keep the little ones. This guy's got big claws on him, so I think he might be worth it. Let's measure him. Okay, so he's, he's almost five and three quarters. He's about five and a half inches. Okay, five and a half. All right, let's put him in here. got another red rock here who's trying to get out. He's not a very good boy. Okay. Another red rock here, male. Nice crab. Here, get the crab. Okay, he's got some good claws. And this guy is five and three quarters. It's a nice crab. Uh, 
Got four in the tank. Go. It's funny when you're sitting on the boat out in the middle of the ocean, you start seeing things, you know? We saw baby dolphins swim by. We saw, we saw a, I don't even know what it's called, a train, a long line of seaweed that went on for like a quarter mile. It was unbelievable. It's just long strands of seaweed connected together, floating along. Um, waiting for something good to happen. Hopefully we catch some crab. But anyways, killing time. We'll check back later. All right, so one good red rock crab. Check him out. Okay. All right, we're going to show you uh, what it takes to do micro crab fishing. You try to catch the smallest crab, and I think Rye just pulled up the smallest crab of the year. I have no idea what kind of species this is. It's definitely not a Dungeness. Check it out. Okay, so we'll gently release this guy. And we just got our first dungy. Looks like a keeper. We'll take a look here and measure it up. Show that crap to the camera. Female red rock crab. We throw females back almost always. Okay, hold on. Let's see. Show the bottom. Nice male. Or right, up one claw. Nail one claw. Let's measure them up. There's golden. You can already see it. Okay, good. Total keeper. First dungy. Let's go. He's beating me. He's trying to dig my feet up. No, he'll he'll push your hands yeah. up to his claws. Let's That's see. what he's trying hold to do. Hold him up so hold his back up. Nice big red rock crab. He's like over five. Oh, he's and this is a little young female dungeness. I'm gonna let her go. Whoa. No, he's down investigating our crab pot. Look, watch, you'll see him on here. Two sea lions. How deep? They're halfway, they're 30 feet under the boat. Well, let me see if I can get a good shot of that. So that's what it looks like. I'll measure them for you, but that's a big crab right there. And a little one. This guy's pretty good right here. Big male keeper. Let me turn the wow, look at that. Huge crab. He's a, let's see how big he actually is. Put on that side and then read the number. He's over six. Over six male. Let's go, baby. Dungeon. Look at me. Three. All right, quick summary. We're going to flash over to our catch and cook in a few minutes, but we're here at the West Side Boat Launch picking up the boat. Took it out of the water. I think we got about 10 crabs. We'll do a count when we get home. Overall, not a great day, but not a bad day. Anyways, uh, we'll see you in a minute back at the catch and cook. Okay, so we, we caught our crab, we cleaned our crab, and now we're going to cook our crab. In order to cook the crab, you wanna cook them for about 12 to 15 minutes in a boiling pot of water. 
it's good to put some salt water in that pot and also maybe a quarter cup of or half cup of white vinegar it helps the meat a little bit it's pretty good uh, anyway so here's the crab that we have all cleaned and dispatched and we're gonna take it over here come on over here Keek. and we're gonna put that in there a little bit at a time make note of the time this will cook up nice And just like that, we have fresh Dungeness and Red Rock Crab from Northern California. Coop, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel. And uh, we got a lot of great videos coming out. 2019 is going to be amazing. Thank you guys. We love you guys. What we do is we boil a pot of water and we put some salt in it and we put salt in it and we put about a cup of white vinegar in it it helps sweeten the huh? okay about a half a cup we put about a half a cup of white vinegar in it we put about <laughs> it smells like garbage <laughs> so we about a half a cup we put about a half of uh, we put about a half a cup of white vinegar in it we put about <laughs> <laughs> you had it and you lost all the shots. All the guns. I can buy a belly, don't talk to me. For a show, 150, don't talk to me. You ain't never help your mans, don't talk to me. Fuck a bar, fuck a bar. Get in the sky, I'm a fucking star. Fuck a star. I don't fall in love, cause I've been living hard. Do every day, let me shirt. We've been drifting for three days, lost at sea, but we still got music on YouTube. Just kidding. <laughs>